A close call for people in a Bucks County neighborhood. A small plane crashed just steps from their backyards. A lot to get to on this Tuesday. Thanks for joining us this afternoon. I'm Rosemary Connors. And I'm Jacqueline London. The pilot of the plane was killed. But as you can see from this video, the tragedy could have been much worse. The plane went down around 1030 this morning in a wooded area off Charter Club Drive in Buckingham Township. That's not far from the Doylestown Airport. Thankfully, no one on the ground was injured. NBC 10 Stephen Fisher is live near that scene. Stephen, scary moment for neighbors there. Yeah, Jackie, we are here on Clark Carter Club Drive in uh, this neighborhood. It is chock full of homes. So let me take you right out to where this crash took place. It's right back here through this backyard and through this wooded area. Few, of course, few uh, just back behind some of those branches there, you can see just a small portion of that red plane that crashed. The call of the plane that came down around this morning around 1030 uh, AM. Now, Sky Force 10 also overhead after the crash, giving you a closer look at the damage to the single engine plane that uh, just came down into this wooded area here in Buckingham Township. We're told the plane took off from Doylestown Airport, which is only about a half a mile away from here. Authorities tell us the only person on board was the pilot who has been identified as 79 year old Martin Saylor Jr. He was pronounced dead here at the scene. Neighbors we spoke with today were both startled and stunned by this crash. And I heard an explosion and I looked out and I could see just like a big poop of um, uh, flames. A few years back, I remember there was um, a crash, but it was right in the middle of 611. You know, it's right by that small airport that we have down the road here. Um, but I've never, don't remember anything coming into the neighborhoods. Yeah, and those who knew Martin Saylor, the pilot, said he had many years of experience going back to his days flying in the Navy and then commercial airplanes. Right now, the cause of this crash, it is unknown, but I can tell you the FAA, they are actively investigating this crash. We're live in Buckingham Township. Stephen Fisher, NBC 10 News.